Xbox is really damned if they do, damned if they don't. I'm going to leave a couple examples to explain my point. And mind you, uh, the, the ones that I'm going to show, one is media, the other two are, these, these are not trolls. These aren't PS fans, these aren't haters. These are what Xbox fans have said and are saying that contradicts their own statements. First, Xbox fans was, would say things like uh, how Nintendo and Sony could show gears should, co should show games years out, but Xbox can't do so, and it's frustrating. That's what they're saying in the past, and that's what they're saying for years. Now, Xbox fans are saying that Xbox revealed things too early. How, how is that fair when the community for years was seeing they they were sending messages to Aaron Greenberg and Phil Spencer and the Xbox's personal accounts? Oh, we want to see games early, show things early. And then when Xbox does that, y'all are still complaining. This is the stuff that that, that gives gamers a bad rap, and and I I, I want the community to. Turn, turn her to, you know, kind of think a bit. Stop being so in the moment and listening to every, every, you know, to outside ears that hasn't liked anything Xbox does anyway. Uh, another example I'm, I'm going to use here is somebody talking about how, how, criticizing CGI trailers, how it's hard to get people excited even with gameplay. Sony's done that all generation and nobody said a word. And again, it, it, I, I, I don't think I don't think gamers understand how game development works. It's not 1995 anymore where Rare could put out a quality different game each year. Now, game development is extremely difficult, extremely time consuming, extremely expensive. Uh, it, it takes years to make a quality game. And, and uh, if you look at the responses to annual releases like Madden and 2K and all that, people people don't even like them. They, yeah, uh, it's like it's like people ha uh, hate on 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 those annual franchises all the time. Assassin's Creed stopped being annual franchise because people were getting sick of it. Uh, I mean it's. I, I hope you see my point here. And the last one um, uh, uh, example I'm going to use is from The Verge, who were criticizing that that the Series X won't have any launch exclusive, you know, the that stupid narrative they were trying to push. And then, and then they're complaining that Microsoft, quote unquote, broke its promises when... Oh, all they said is that it was up to the developer. Um, this is why I, I I try to make more positive Xbox related videos. This is why I try to tell people to calm down. It things aren't as bad a, 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 as as a lot of these sites and people make things seem. Uh, it's because it's because of, of stuff like this. Uh, this is the type of stuff that uh. I, I call out not out of not out of hatred or anything, but to show you guys where 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 I feel like we could where where I feel like we need to add perspective to the situation. Xbox had a great show and the Xbox Series X is looking great going forward.